And Crown 4 will continue to monitor developments with those protesters throughout the night tonight. Also, of course, tonight we are tracking one of the biggest storms to head to the Bay Area in years. Crown 4's chief meteorologist Jacqueline Bennett tells us what's ahead. Charles Clifford has the trouble spots bound to succumb to the elements. Jeff Bush is at a sandbag location that's helping people shore up their properties. And Dan Rubin is covering efforts to prevent landslides in San Francisco with repelling rock wranglers chiseling away at the problem. We're going to start with Jacqueline. Jacqueline, how long before that storm comes ashore? Well, Pam, it's going to be about 24 hours from now that we're going to see the rain kick off in the North Bay. Right now, you can see it's just cloudy over the Bay Area. But as we look offshore, the storm is starting to deepen, and we're going to see that rain arrive by tomorrow evening. A flood watch has already been issued for much of the Bay Area because we are expecting really intense rainfall starting Thursday morning, going through the day on Thursday. Rain totals will be anywhere from about 3 to 8 inches throughout the Bay Area. That's a lot of rain to take in in a short period of time, so flash flooding is likely. Here's a look on Futurecast, 8 o'clock, the rain edging into Santa Rosa, then starting to push south into the rest of the North Bay by midnight. And watch this, though. The later morning hours, we're going to see moderate rain, a line of moderate showers come through Santa Rosa. It's going to head down toward Novato at 6, down into San Francisco at 7, down into the East Bay as we head into the 10 o'clock hour. And if that rain stalls at all, that heavy rain stalls at all over any portion of the Bay Area, we're talking about significant flooding issues. We're going to finish timing this out. Out. We'll take a look at the rainfall totals in your neighborhood and snow in the Sierra all coming up. And our team coverage continues. Let's go out live now to Charles and to Jeff, both standing by to help you get prepared for the storm. Charles. Well, this storm is expected to reach the entire Bay Area and across our region. There are certain spots that are prone to problems whenever we get a big storm. In San Francisco, big storms almost always seem to knock down trees and flood streets. Along Ocean Beach, strong winds and storm surges frequently blow sand across the Great Highway, sometimes closing it down for days. In North Beach, heavy rain can sometimes loosen up rocks on Telegraph Hill. They then fall onto the vehicles and buildings below. This car was smashed by a boulder back in 2012. In the South Bay, there's frequent flooding along some of the low-lying areas near the bay. San Fran Sisaquito Creek in Palo Alto is particularly prone to flooding, although efforts have been made in recent years to improve the water flow. In the East Bay, big storms can knock down trees or even trigger mudslides. Water also tends to pool on some of the lower roadways and underpasses. And this is video from Martinez back in 2011 when heavy rains filled up Alhambra Creek. But the area that almost always gets hit the hardest is the North Bay. This is video from Napa back in 2006. And in Marin County, residents always keep a weary eye on San Anselmo Creek. In 2006, the creek flooded all of downtown San Anselmo. Following big storms, flooding is also common here along Highway 101 and also here near Marin City. All right, back live now. Even if you don't live near one of those trouble spots, authorities are warning people that this storm is expected to hit every corner of the Bay Area, and they're warning, warning folks to be safe out there. In the North Bay, Charles Clifford at Cron 4 News. Crown4.com is also your storm prep resource. We have listed nearly 100 sandbag locations to help you find one near you in case you need them. Also, details on how to store food and keep your family safe during any potential extended power outage and how to react to a flash flood. The link is on our homepage, Crown4.com.